<laughs> Let's play! Whoa! Hello there, ladies and gentlemen, you all may call me Pharaoh, and welcome back to Let's Play Mario and Luigi Dream Team. Last time we left off, we were climbing the uh, dream version of Mount Pajamja, and it looks like we're just at the summit here. Uh, I'm not sure what the hell's going to happen. We, we, we need to open up the dream portal again so we can get out of here. Well, also somehow avoiding the sleep beats or sleepy beats, whatever the hell they're called. So, let's see what's going to happen here. I'm sure all's well. Hopefully. Yeah, this, this is it. Here we go. Oop. The summit. Ye who have seized the summit, thy muscles know no bounds. No, not bounds, I should say. Is there something behind us? Oh, no. Well, I think I know what's coming up. We need some whitening strips as well. Good job, Luigi. There you go. Oh, boy. Are you well? Things still waking up. See, I just look at the word yawn. Oh, I got a yawn. When did your voice become so hoarse? No. Who wakes me? <laughs> this mountain, it lives? Mm. In that case, we must find a way to make it erupt. If we go to interrupting, the dream portal might open. Oh yeah. Well, I can punch it. Does that work? Probably not, but Let's see, we do this. Do that. Do this. Oops. Wake up. Crap, spikes. I, I'm not even getting hit. I, I just keep going to the, to the, the left eventually. I should uh, help out. No. Come on, it's getting there. Oh. I can't tell like rhyme or reason if it's gonna go to the right or left. There you go. How dare you! That hurt! Oh boy. Am I gonna have to switch it again? Huh? Luigi? Am I just imagining things? He's not sleeping as deeply. Oh, we must flee this place quickly! Hurry, you two! They've got to be really dizzy after all that. Oh, great, we're a snowball. Well, we're back where we started. Oh, your return from Sky is amazing. Luigi uh, might be dead. Uh, hold on. There you go. Oh, this isn't ominous at all. What? Uh, shaking beef is rumbling muscles. Okay, we guys have nowhere to go yet. Yeah, the dream portal isn't open up yet. Great. 
Yeah, we're gonna get big. What's your problem? Gotta teach you a lesson. Uh, we do. Now's the perfect time for you to get big. It's coming right for us. Does it mean to ram us? Luigi, is something happening again? The L mark is shining. I've seen this before. Well, here we go. Must help, bro. No, keep touching it. Gotta help my big bro. No, come on. Why is it? I don't know why it doesn't. Oh, there it goes. Oh, boy. I'll be right back. Alrighty, here we go. Look, I actually have a little bit of a background, but unfortunately I have the, um... It's the rest of the capture software having the black, the black around. Um... It'd be finicky to try cutting it out because it then's gonna mess up the other capture, so... At least there's something on the, uh, top and bottom a little bit. <laughs> This is our second big dreamy Luigi fight. Let's see if I remember how to do this. I don't think I need to translate that. Oh, that looks impenetrable. If only there was a way to break his guard. Oh, why not try using the hammer uppercut? I'm well trained to hammer uppercuts. Shall I teach you? Sure. Touch the hammer icon. Now we have to do the hammer uppercut. Slide quickly in the arrow's direction to swing the hammer vertically. Here. Okay. The hammer uppercut launched the foe backward. Now for now for Jimmy Luigi, he sprawls defenseless. Or will Marion unleash a bro attack? Okay, bro attack icon. Hey, we got something new here instead of just, you know, healing up. The drill stomp icon. Oh. Make circles in the arrow's direction to make Mario spin faster. Okay. Oh, more. If you make lots of circles, the arrow will appear again. Then make more circles. Okay. More. Oh, other way, other way. Now spin the other direction. Be, be ever mindful. Okay. There you go. Ow. I feel bad for his nose, man. We've been just hitting it all this time. When Jill stop ends, Mario will flag and need rest. As with the Rhythm Mushroom. You won't be able to use bro attacks for a bit, so make use of them wisely. Crap, what the hell is this counter attack gonna be? Well, now he's really stuffed up. Uh, stuffed up, I should say. Ah, that's gonna hurt a little. All right. Well, it looks like I keep doing the same thing because I'm sure if I jump on him, I'll jump in the volcano. I don't want that. So, and I don't know if I can do like the side. So I'm gonna do the uppercut again. 
which I think at this point I can go ahead and use a jump or the other um, the side hit. I can just try. I'll do the side hit here. I don't know if there's anything in the background to launch into, but. Yeah, I probably shouldn't have done that, but I wanted to test it out. Oh boy. Oh, I, I thought I was supposed to jump. Push back, push back, push back. Okay. Oh, all right. Another drill stomp it is then. Just gotta be mindful of the spin. Okay. I don't know what happened there. I definitely started spinning, and I w it was in the right direction, too. I don't know what happened there. Damn it. That looked like it didn't connect, but what whatever. Oop. <laughs> okay, that, that one obviously didn't work. Okay. Uh... So this time, I'm, I'm going to try jumping. Hopefully that deals a little bit more damage than just smacking him to the side. There you go. Yeah, jumping seems to work really well when he's on, on his back like that. Okay, I'll stick with that. Now I'm going to get super heated. Uh-oh. I think I got hit for a little bit there. Okay, well, that's in the... Well, wait, that's not in the background. It's actually behind him. Hmm. Can I actually do an uppercut? Uh... If I jump on his nose, I'm, I'm not really sure how this is going to work. I'm going to have to test a few things here. Let's try an uppercut. Okay, apparently that's what we, I was supposed to do. That was easy enough. Good. Now there's something in the background. Okay. So let me do this. Do another uppercut. Get you on your back. Okay, maybe not. Uh-oh. Maybe I... Oh, that sucks. Maybe I should have... Uh, Hit him already to the, in the back without... It is what it is. I, I almost did that one too early. See, I, I didn't think if I hit him to the, in the back right now if he would have actually done anything. And I don't even know if the thing's still there, so... This will put him on his back. I can't tell if it's still in the background or not. I, frankly, I don't think it is. Uh, I'll play it safe. There you 
go. He's hurting. Just a little bit more to go. Could you not? I actually take a little bit of damage. If it passes that circle like in any degree, you're screwed. Okay. But we're still doing okay, I think. And knock it back. Knock it on my head. Nice little chip damage there. Now here's what I'm not sure what to do next. So that's there. So I guess I do want to hit it to the side so that one gets blocked up. Yes, that's exactly what I want to do. Then I'll hit him in his head. Good. Oh, and then he just automatically goes on his... Okay. Now, let's try the freaking drill top again thing, or move. Okay. I do not know why I can't get excellent on that anymore. Like, I'm spinning like crazy, but it may not be registering properly, so... It's okay. We tried. We're almost done. Push him back, push him back, push him back, push him back. Okay. And just for ease of use, we'll go ahead and just jump. All right. Now, either it'll allow me to do the final hit, or... I may have to like damage him just a teeny bit more because he still has a sliver of health left. Jeez. Come on. Just so little left. Mm. Or are we ready? It's time! The foe's weak and ripe for defeat! Okay, oh, so it doesn't have to be like where it has to be completely gone. It just has to be like a very sliver left. Alright. I love this move. Make sure I aim properly, though. All right, here we go. I was like, wait. Ooh, ooh, ooh. It's a little finicky, a little finicky. I got that one last minute. Last minute. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, that's a fun first 20 minutes of the, the video. <laughs> the fight itself probably took, like, what, 10? But, I mean, they they tend to, you know, I hate saying drag a little bit. I still enjoy these. I mean, granted, we only had two of them, but it makes me look forward to what we're going to see later on. So, by defeating the mountain itself, uh, Ultra Candy, Ultra Nut, and 1-Up Deluxe, and Metal Gloves. That might be interesting to see what the hell that's all about. Time to go back to normal. Eventually. Alright, let me switch this back. 
And back to normal we are. Hey, look, the dream portal. Woo! A heated battle. The dream portal's finally back. The eruption is making Luigi sleep less soundly. We can now return to the real world. Yeah, but what about those sound beats or sleep beats? But what awaits us? Let us make haste. All right. We have too much time in that dream point. Oh. It doesn't look like the music's playing anymore. Oh, the portal disappeared! What happened in there? The dream beats made Luigi sleep uh, too deeply. Oh, dream beats. I can't call them the sleepy beats. But somehow we found our way back out. Gaha, oh no, of course he's... Wide awake. Wait, wide awake now, are we? Bowser! The Dreamstone has been restored. I impossible! Oh. Oh, really? Feast your eyes. Just gotta dig in here somewhere. There it is. The shiny rock here is gonna give us the entire world. Yeah, hear that cushion? And it's gonna grab my wishes. And you know who's gonna stop me? Not you guys. We must start our conquest. Oh, uh, well, we're screwed. Peach is in danger! Bowser with three free wishes? He'll definitely go after her! You speak truly. We must protect her. We need to get back to Pillow Castle immediately! Wait. Be at one we're waiting. Something stirs my memory. Yes! The warp pipe block! So here it is, here it is where it was hidden? What is that? Mario, would you strike that for me? Uh, okay. I'm going to assume now we have fast travel. What? What is it? What happened? Warp pipes. The pipes connect in mystical ways. They shall ease our island travel. I hit the block that unlocks them when we fought in Tasma a long time ago. It is so conveniently right here. Yes, I hit it here. And forgotten time. Yes, I remember it clearly now. Are you kidding me? Why didn't you mention this incredibly convenient thing earlier? Uh, I forgot. Just, just let it go. In any case, the pipes should be scattered around the island now. If my mind's eye is true, I recall one in that cave over there. And another lies within Pillow Castle. The warp pipe will deliver us instantly. But listen well. New warp pipes will not activate until you use them at least once. So if you find one somewhere, use it y use it lest you forget about it. Well, thanks to Forget Bird's ter terrible memory, we've been hoofing it around for no reason. But now we're in the game. Wait, I'm the bad guy? Forget Bird. Okay, so do you guys remember that one area that's like seemingly odd? Like one screen, like technically in Blimport, um, it was kind of to the right of the Pillow Castle, I think. Uh, that I'm assuming is where the uh, one of the warp pipes is gonna be at. So good to know. Ooh, ooh, thank God I went up here. Can I actually go back though to where they were? I didn't really get the chance to investigate because. Buttholes. Hey, where are you guys going? We need to find the warp pipe to return to Pillow Castle. Yeah, I know, but I, there's an area I didn't get to explore. Ugh. Dang it, Starlow. No, I don't want to go back. Ugh. Well, it is what it is. At least I got a couple beans out of it. Um, well, can I use a side drill just to... But, okay, that's not what I want to do, but... I just want to see if I can actually cross this without having to do the, uh... Yeah, okay. It's actually a little bit faster if I instead of doing a spin jump. Over there! That's it! A warp pipe! Yeah. 
Kind of like how the like, outer rim kind of looks like it has runes on it. Mario, be at one of that pipe. All right, you don't got to tell me twice. I mean, we've been doing this for, uh, what, 30 plus years? Close to 40? They, they know how to work with these pipes. All right, so yeah, we have... We're at Mount Pajamja Peak, and then we have Pillow Castle Lobby. Is this okay? Well, it's the only thing we have. Cool. Um, well, I don't remember. No, this wasn't always here. Or, like, was there, like, a little symbol here or something indicating, like, hey, there you go. Um, oh, you're still scrubbing? Dude, I left you, like, 20 hours ago. Whatever. And it's kind of I actually wanted to come back here anyway, because I want to check out the shop and all that, and the badge and the badges, so this worked out. Excuse me, have you seen Princess Peach? Come again? Princess Peach? Oh yeah, she went to Driftwood Shore with Toesworth. Something about it being safer to hide that hide there until you came back. Driftwood Shore, huh? Got it. Thanks. Mario, to Driftwood Shore. Shake a leg. Okay. Uh, go through Mushrise Park to get to Drift Driftwood Shore. Okay, no, I, I know where it's at. Oh, hold on. Hey, wait, I'm not... Don't kick me out. Oh, they just actually came back to the peak. Uh-huh. The Dream Stone has been restored. Now we begin to conquer the world. Solid, let's do it. Where to begin, though? Hmm. Think, minions. All oh, right, boss. Um, how about we steal the world's food and then eat it? Sir, four simple words. Fan club with rewards. You fools, be more smart. I have already thought of a thing we will need. Really? What? A castle. To conquer the world, we will need a castle. Hmm, a castle, huh? Good point. Yeah, castle. I can just left mine at home. So we can create a base on the island and conquer the world from that? Genius. We'll build the best castle on the whole island, yeah. A new castle for just us. It will be strong. Castle. Castle. Build it! You didn't say I wish, but okay. Well, remember that one area that was still blank? I'm assuming that this is what this area is. This is probably gonna be the, the castle's gonna be the final area of the game. More than likely, it always is. Uh, hey, that, that looks evil and spiky. Um, it's not the best looking castle I've seen. Even the even the bottoms are spiky. Oh, it's, just, it's gonna be floating, that's why. Gotcha. Floating evil spiky castle. Like, I haven't seen that one in 20 zillion times. So this is my new pad, huh? Oh yeah, I like it. This dreamstone ain't too shabby. Ah, you like it, yes. Yeah, I like it. You don't have to screech at me. Anyway, it's perfect for world conquering. And I'll name it Neo Bowser Castle. Neo Bowser Castle. Ah, you may call it however you like, of course. But let us take it for a test drive. Yes, let us try it out. Uh, okay. Oh, look, a spider leg thing's great. And the claw? Or no, is this supposed to look like Entasma? I think that's what's happening. Oh, look, no, thing, beam. Great, where is that firing? Uh, I didn't get a chance to go to any of those islands. I, I don't think I'm able to. Crap. Oh, and it has an evil barrier. This guy's just cheating at this point. 
Whoa, whoa! Well, oh, the island's gone. That is scary. Yes, yeah, awesome! This thing's nasty. Well, this castle, we can do whatever the hell we want. I didn't say that exactly, still. You are next in line, Honorable Bowser. And it's time you fished for yourself. Can do, buddy. Oh. Uh oh. Whoa, whoa. Bad, bad thing. Some terror castle appeared and zapped the surrounding islands. Help. Help. We should bail! It's too dangerous! It appears Antasma and Bowser have put their plan into motion. We need to make tracks of Driftwood Shore so we can find Princess Peach. She might be their next target. Oh, no. Well, hold on. I'm going to go back. Maybe, maybe the guys are still in here selling things. Hopefully. Um, let's see. You have anything new? Um. No. Wow, wait a minute. Do the shops not update? Oh, that, 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 that's not good. Okay. Well, that's a disappointment. Do you have the last couple badges by, by chance? Sure don't. So I'm missing two for Mario, one for Luigi. They could be part of the expert uh, challenges. If there's like a boss goblin like how there was in Inside Story, they may be there. Um, or it could be the skill of I, I totally forgot about that too. Damn. Well, hold on. Let, let's. I want to take a look around really quick. So I've been all the way here. There's a warp pipe. I haven't... These places have been closed off since the beginning. Maybe they're open now? Oh, wow, they are. Let's finally see what these are all about. It's a big dining hall. A huge castle appeared in the sky and the barrier islands disappeared. You should have seen the stampede. Everyone bolted out of here. Just me, I would have done the same thing if I wasn't on, on mug scrubbing duty. Y you'd think a world ending event would excuse you from doing a little bit of work. Uh. There's. No one here? There was. Got some coins. Is that literally all there is here? There's still dining hall? Let me talk to the one other person that's in here then. This place is supposedly the place to make a paler who, but people are avoiding me like I have a who in my hand. In fact, this place kind of feels deserted as who. All right. Well, I guess you can who off from here. So what is the area to the right then? Oh, wait a minute. That's actually two two separate things. Uh. So it's over here. This room. I wonder what it's for. It's pretty wild in here. It's as if most of the castle has changed, but this area remains the same. Dreambird, do you know this place? Of course. Remember, this castle originally belonged to me. I'll be your tour guide. Please try to keep up. If you enjoy a good challenge, you'll love the Battle Ring! Here you will dream about fighting fearsome foes you've encountered, but they'll be even more stronger than before. You'll also get prizes for defeating them. Oh, yeah, so this is exactly like the, um... It's the, like the gauntlet in Inside Story. The challenge of your dreams awaits. Now, I'm not gonna actually fight anything, I'm just kinda curious to see how it's gonna look. Um, so I'm hoping it'll just give us like a menu. I actually don't want to fight. Okay, yeah, so same thing as before. Man. So there's a total of six, seven, eight, nine, and we already have our five. 
Uh, we had to, and of course, we have to pay the entry fee. Uh, and then we have certain term turn li limits uh, to finish off these bites uh, fights uh, in a certain amount of time. So. Uh, I definitely won't do these now. Um, now it tells you like they have recommended level for each one. I'm like level what twenty something. So, I mean, I may or may not want to be able to take these on yet <laughs> if I if I decide to fight now. But uh, there you go. Uh, and of course, giant battles, uh, which. Oh, wait, they... Oh, they do have turn lim limits as well, which I guess makes sense because the Bowser fights... I, I wouldn't say they were scripted, per se. I mean, kind of-ish. Um, but, you know, these giant these giant fights obviously are more dependent on how well we fight with Big Dreamy Luigi. Uh, so, 10 turns, 13 turns. Okay. Uh, now, it doesn't... It doesn't have, like, oh, you should be this level, because I don't think it's going to matter here, so... Uh, okay. So, I don't know if you guys want to see any of that. Um, maybe I'll do, like, a penultimate episode where I go in there and check things out, but... Uh, either way. So, now we know where to go if you want to do these challenges. And it's very possible that the prizes they give us will be pretty nice. Um... But there you go. And actually, let me see something here. What is my level at? We're 22. So, I think, like, there's, like, what, two, two, maybe three of those fights I can take on as recommended levels. But, um, there you go. Or maybe I'll do them off screen. I'm not really sure how I want to handle those. Still can't get... There's, I don't know, I hope we get a high jump or something. There's, there's a lot of places we have yet to be able to reach because of this. Um, okay. Well, I guess that's that for Pillow Castle. And that We have to go to Driftwood Shore. There's like the bottom left area. I love how the, now that... Peach well and Toadsworth. Oh, all of a sudden the fire marshal isn't worried about the capacity. Is it possible maybe a few people cleared out since then? Sure, but eh. Now where was that area that had like a random Huh. I'm trying to I, I guess maybe it's not considered Blimport? Maybe it's Mushrise Park. I don't know. Like, I'm taking a look at the map, I'm like, where the fudge was it? Or was it technically Samdam Woods? Well, I didn't want to do that. I wanted to, like, hit you so I can finish this fight immediately. Actually, it's a good idea I did this because... There. <laughs> huh. <coughs> Holy crap, 445. Well, that's what happens when I'm level 22 fighting basically level 1 enemies. Oh, okay. I was kind of hoping to give me an item. That's, that's kind of the reason why I want to hit them really quick is like, oh yeah, more more money. Uh, there should be another one. There you go. An automatic win. Now, once again, I know I mentioned this while back, but the idea that, uh, I wish more RPGs did this, kind of like an Earthbound, where if you're really strong, and you attack something, uh, you just automatically win. Gold pipe! What the hell? There's so many now. Hmm. Well, didn't they say that... I'm a little bit confused now. <clears throat> I thought they said I had to test it out or use it once before they become available. Huh. Let me check out the base really quick. 
Yeah, so these are just kind of like in like straight up random areas. I thought there was gonna be like a designated spot, like maybe we've seen it, like it looked different, something like that, but I guess not. Um, let's go back to the maintenance hut <coughs> because we saved a lot of pillows. And I'm hoping the L Dream will give me something really nice. And maybe that one area to the bottom there is actually opened up now. Hey, can I help you? Hey, you, you oh, the pillows you rescued. Let's see. Uh, the two have you have saved 28 pillows so far. Woo, we've already saved that many. Huh, I'll save this until you help 18. Birthday ring! Hey! Even more birthday gear! Oh man, this actually might be overkill. Ooh, I should use that for the gauntlet. <laughs> I was saving this until you helped 26 pillows! Goldenware! Ooh! Alright, if you see any other pills around, please help them! Yes, yeah, say 37! Okay. So we got quite a bit more to go now. So let's take a look at some of the stuff. I, we also have those metal gloves I've yet to check out, but um, <clears throat> metal gloves. No special effects, just boosts up your defense by 25. That, that's good. Uh, but do I want to get rid of anything? Ah, see the power goes on like crazy. I, mean, I like these perfect power gloves too. Uh, all right, I guess we're still keeping that on. Now we have Goldenware. Increases your defense based on the number of coins you have. That I have a good number of coins. But my power, though... I don't want to take that much hit of, of, of POW. Well, there you go. What else do I have? Birthday ring, right? Increases the chance of lucky hits on the day of your birth. Happy birthday! <laughs> okay. Um. Well, that's, uh... It's good to have, but, like, once again, for my play style, I, I don't want to sacrifice the power. Uh, are you going to allow me down here? Of course not. Oh. Hold the line, even if it's an uproar. See, I would have figured that would have been the best time to go and check things out, but, um... <clears throat> and why can't I go here again? Damn, I can't remember. Is there any other place I haven't checked that around here? It's just, it's just the screen I'm on now. Oh, the screen below me, too. And... Yeah, I think there are blocks or, or rocks uh, stopping me uh, in the upper right. But I'm going to double check now. Now that I have the uh, side drill, maybe I can break them. But it, it may still do that thing where I didn't hit it, did I? Of course I didn't. I may still have to hit him, like, uh, on the side that's cracked, so, we'll see, um, I don't know what you thought you were trying to do, but it's not gonna work. Oh, come on, there you go. I'm afraid to jump on them. I mean, I guess, like... Maybe I could jump on them. Because uh, I think the preemptive strikes, they don't take into consideration like if, they, if they're spiky, you know, uh, hot, or any, anything that would hurt if I actually jumped on them in battle. So. <clears throat> okay. So. Over here. Yeah. Let, let's just see if this works. Nope. Okay, and obviously we still can't get up here because reasons, so... Alright, I'll come back eventually. <clears throat> what I want to do now before we go to Driftwood Shore is, um... 
We got a couple of those, uh, of Kylie, uh, Koopa's, the, the snapshots stuff. Actually, I was gonna say, like, where the hell did I, uh, where is the freaking golden pipe? Um, but we have a couple of them that I would like to turn in and do, and I'll just fast forward through the puzzles, you know. You guys don't have to see me suffer through all of them. <coughs> um, I didn't want to do items. I wanted to see if you have any new gear. Probably not. Uh, it looks like, yeah. It, yeah so it, it looks like these... The gears are going to be locked into whatever area we were visiting. So, like, maybe if we go to Driftwood Shore, Samnam Woods, like, they may have better gear for us. That's the idea, anyway. But, now, I'd like to go to downtown Wakeport. Takes us right by the hotels. Yeah, I don't remember that anything being right there. Now, what areas did I not really visit here, per se? I think it was just up here, but yet, like... You need to be able to reach the top portion to be able to do anything else. So, there's that. Uh, which I think I'm not able to do yet. So, feel free to correct me if I'm wrong, but then again, these, I'm recording these videos pretty early you know, in advance here. So, alright Kylie, let's see what photos we have here. I think I got like two others. So we got Mount Pajamaja and the Blimport. All right. Ah, uh, well. So I wonder, did I? Where the hell's the one for the Pillow Castle then? I think I haven't really been. I haven't really investigated the areas again. You know, since I've been there. So. Either way. Let's go ahead and work on these, and I'll, uh, I'll be right back when I finish this one. Well, that was simple enough. Well done, fellas. Nailed it under target time. 100 coins. Thank you. And now... Now, <clears throat> as they, they mentioned before, all these levels, all they mean is that they they zoom in really close for the first one. Level 2 is a little zoomed out. And level 3, eventually when we get it, it'll be fully zoomed out. And there's more and more pieces that go along with it. So, that's, uh, that's all there is to it. Let's see if I can solve this one. Okay. You know, these really aren't that bad. <clears throat> Level 3 might be a little bit more, but... I mean, there, there's enough, like, really striking characteristics on, the, on these puzzles so far that you can really easily focus on uh, certain areas, and then they kind of just fill out nicely. So, there you go. Now, do they only give us coins? I really thought they gave us something else, so... All right, here's the full picture. This is gonna be fun to do. Of course, Luigi's just face planting back there. It's normal. All right, here we go.
All right. Yeah. These aren't that bad. Actually, I kind of like doing these. <laughs> so. Oh, yeah. We get beans. Okay. <coughs> Excuse me. Now I'm kind of curious what, what happens if we get all the blocks here. Or, like, all the, um, the puzzles to do. But. Okay. Oh, this should be fun. All right. Let's do Mount pajama -ja. <clears throat> All right, I don't know why I was getting confused for a teeny bit there from one of the pieces, but there you go. Let's see how level two looks like. Damn, that's level two? Why does this look like super involved? And I thought... I thought all the, these things just gradually zoom out. This looks like a whole different portion of it. Well, I guess it kind of zoomed out. We see, well, we like, you know, Dream Bert to the top right there. Oh, okay. We should be good. And there you go. Barely spent more time than the first level there. <clears throat> All right, let's see how the full picture is going to be like, though. This one, I might be a little worried. I mean, <coughs> it does seem very um, busy, but uh, I'm sure we can do this. Okay, there, there were some areas I were like, oh, I can't exactly tell where they fit in nicely, but yeah, I if you guys decide to go <clears throat> to do these, they're really not difficult to do per se. Um, Stash Bean DX, nice. <clears throat> so, we have the Blimp Port, Wake Port, and Mount Pajama Jaw. So we have one... Crap. One, two, three, four, five, five or six, whatever. We have a good amount to go still <clears throat> for those. Um, I'll keep my eyes peeled for areas that we've, you know, been to before, like need to revisit to see um, what I can grab. And, uh, simply take things from there. <clears throat> now, I'm not really sure where I'm at in terms of this video. Wait, why are you all... What's wrong with you? Oh, they, oh, they ran away. That's right. Now, wait a minute. What about all the ones that fell asleep? Like, did they wake up now and it's like, oh, crap, what the hell? Like, we gotta run. I have no idea. Can I actually leave? No. Okay, what is the best way to, uh... What is the best way to Driftwood Shore? 
I, I was just gonna walk there from here, but I'm not sure if that that will be faster than just simply doing this. Let me go to the Dozing Island, Dozing Sands entrance. Uh, oh yeah, no, no, this is perfect. So we only, we've been here just very little, just to get some beans and items in there. Uh, actually, holy, before I forget, we have a couple beans here, so, heart bean, those will go to Mario, including the DX, defense bean, Luigi there, who's getting the stash? Ooh, well, there. Not any of the other stashes we'll give to uh, Luigi for the time being. I, I want them to be kind of even with that one, so. <clears throat> so they denied me entry earlier because it was too crowded. And now I can't enter because some need-to-know garbage? Ridiculous! Those security guys are power tripping like crazy. <clears throat> I apologize. For a confidential reason, so I cannot permit you past here. But, but, nope. You have been, you've been warned. Uh, uh, uh. Huh? But well, you exude uh, justice and mustache. Are you Mario by any chance? Hoo ah! But that means this other guy with the mustache is Luigi. Well, he's completely inconsequential. Wow. Mario, Princess Peach came to this beach. We understand it was to escape Bowser. That was enough to make us close the beach down. The idea is to keep any suspicious types out. In any case, Princess Peach is waiting for you guys. Hurry to your rendezvous. She's this way. Okay. Thank you. Now we are free to uh, kind of explore Driftwood Shore. And this looks like it's going to be like a smaller area because uh, there doesn't seem to be... Oh, great. I can't even here. <clears throat> there doesn't seem to be a lot of pillows or beans here, but, um, we'll see how it goes. Well, there's the warp pipe. Um, let me go ahead and just get in there really quick so it, it just appears for us. There we go. I hope it doesn't, like, tell us, like, we have to, um go some other place and then come back here in order for it to pop up. That, that suck. So they said this is like the shopping area. I mean, I, I guess you, you, you want that in beaches, sure. Oh, ah, the dearest Mr.'s Mario and Luigi. We've awaited you. Your presence is requested in the room to the rear. Please head that way. I didn't get to explore. Oh, well. Can I leave? Mr. Mario, Mr. Luigi, Princess Peach away too. This way. This is very gaudy. Like. Okay. Quality first. Originality, assurance, affordable cost. Products for you, passion for us, prices for both. Rose Bouquet. Pursuit of the best materials. Proficiency at all relevant skills. Persistence at providing upscale goods. Everything in our shop is lovingly handmade, crafted by gifted hands over countless hours so that we may produce the finest quality products. Rose Bouquet. Now, is this going to be one of those things where, like, oh, depending on my scale, I'm able, I'm able to get certain things? Like, are you going to let me in? Well, the Princess Peach is in the room in the back, says. Your presence is request in the back room, says. Please proceed rearward. We have all sizes available, of course. Do not hesitate to ask for assistance. Do who guys see it? A castle appeared. Whew! Then nearby islands. Boom! It was a real who down for a show, but I'll tell who that. It says we'd like to purchase something. The back counter staff will assist you. Wow, we! I ain't never seen so many fancy duds and such. You just go on and choose whatever you like, little darling. Say the word and I'll buy this whole dang shop. Yes, sirree. Wow, we, cutie pie. Okay, you're rather going debt. Wow, Mario! I heard there was a big show outside. Can't believe I missed it with the castle appearing. Wow, we the closing this here boutique are fashy old nabble. 
Ain't fine enough in this nice bag in the Bean Bean Kingdom, nope. We make only the hottest items available for you. And yeah, we'll see about that. What do you got for me? Welcome, sirs. Welcome to the silver shop. Uh, no special effects. Restore some BP when you deal damage. That's, that's actually kind of nice. I mean, same thing with the heart boots, but now these are bro boots. What are the singularity boots? Or singular boots. Their price, they have a good boost, don't get me wrong, but for that damn price, ugh. Um, possibly will make struck enemies dizzy. Ugh. So a ball more, what does it do? More HP, more defense. How is still gonna go down like crazy for any of these? The fancy wear, lots of defense, lots of speed, lots of lots of stash too. But once again, power goes down. The gloves, oh, thirty percent. Hmm. Completely protects you from all status effects, which frankly we haven't really gotten many unless they're gonna come later on in the game. Uh I mean the thing is is like I really like what I have on. It just sucks that that that's a lot of pow. Same thing with like the well the the knockout hammer I feel like I haven't really been hasn't really been doing much for me. Um, I'll get, you know what, yeah, I'll do that, so I just gotta remember to use the hammer more with Mario, same thing with Luigi, I keep saying like, I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna do that, and I just keep forgetting about it, the experience boots I don't really want to give up at all, um, the flame hammer, I swear, I haven't really seen it do much for me either, so... You know what? I think I'll just give him the spin hammer instead. Let's see if that makes him dizzy at the very least. Uh, I don't know if I want to pay 400 more for, what, six pow, maybe? Uh... I mean, he's pretty strong. Uh, yeah, we'll, we'll, just, we'll just try to spin hammer. Screw it. Now we give we have the POW gloves, but they don't have like POW gloves DX anything like that. No. Okay, so I I know I could be upgrading their stuff better, but I just I like the effects of some of the others. So I I love the guard shell. I love them gaining HP back if need be. Um. Yeah. So I'm not sure when the gold shop opens up. Uh. It could be related to my rank, or they just want me to progress the story. I'm not 100% certain on that. Either way, uh, I think I'm going to go ahead and call it an episode for today, because I'm not really sure where I'm at in terms of time. But, yeah, I'll go ahead and just call it an episode for right now. And then, uh, next time, ladies and gentlemen, we will visit Peach and uh, take things from there, I believe. Oh, uh, you know what? Hold on. Now, just that I have the bean. Before I forget, I'm gonna go ahead and use it. And actually, let's see. There's... Yeah, there's only three pillows here somewhere we gotta save. In terms of beans, ten. So... It, yeah, it, it looks like it's really out of the areas right now that um, we need still need to go through. It's, yeah, Driftwood Shore and then Samnon Woods. And then I'm assuming Neo Bowser Castle, but... uh. It seems like the majority island we kind of went through, so sounds good. So, as usual, thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you all next time for Let's Play Mario & Luigi Dream Team. Love you all so much, and don't forget to spread that love around. Have a great day, everybody.